Hemothorax Introduction Hemothorax is the collection of whole blood in contrast with bloody effusion in the pleural cavity. It is most commonly due to penetrating or blunt trauma. It may also be a complication of a ruptured intrathoracic aortic aneurysm, which is fatal in most of the cases. It may also be due to iatrogenic trauma, for example, central venous catheter placement. Clinical Features If significant blood loss is seen, then there will be hypotension, tachycardia. If hemothorax is due to trauma, then one can find a chest wall deformity, paradoxical chest wall movement, and crepitus on palpation. Diagnosis is by chest x-ray. Chest ultrasound allows for detection of small volumes of blood. A hyperechogenic signal is first seen in the costodiaphragmatic recess, commonly used in the FAST protocol for trauma assessment. Chest CT shows hyperattenuation of fluid. Pleural fluid analysis shows red blood cells. The pleural hematocrit level is more than or equal to 50% of the patient's peripheral hematocrit level. Treatment Chest tube, thoracostomy with blood evacuation, surgical exploration and repair in the case of massive hemothorax of more than 1000 ml, continuing bleeding 150 to 200 ml per hour for 2 to 4 hours, sustained hemodynamic instability requiring repeated transfusions. Note A hemothorax, however small, must always be drained because blood in the pleura cavity will clot if not evacuated, resulting in a trapped lung or an emphyma. With hemothorax, in contrast with bloody pleural effusions, the blood clots within the pleural cavity.